hello guys welcome back to my channel today we will learn a sign in method this method is google sign in today we will learn how users uh, can log in uh, inside our application using uh, google sign in as you can see our uh, application uh, is ready if you click the this continue with google uh, button yes we can uh, select any uh, account for example, this design that Burak, and yes, uh, this Burak that tells you uh, my name and my surname. But this information come from uh, my Google account. If you click this logout button, application goes to uh, first page. Okay, let's start the video. First of all, I want to create a new project. Google new just wait uh, to prepare Android Studio our project and yes first of all I want to add uh, Firebase inside our project we will use authentication uh, Google Kotlin uh, there are two button in here uh, first button is connect to Firebase and second button second uh, button uh, works uh, for add some dependencies inside our project and I want to create a brand new project Firebase project Google name, uh, name is okay for me. Uh, it's it's not a big project. We can continue. Select uh, default account for Firebase. We are waiting uh, in the step. Continue. And let's look Android Studio. As you can see, launching web connect flow. flow. If uh, we click this connect button, uh, this view will be gone. Let's try. As you can see, and uh, we continue first step, and now we can add. Uh, we can click the, the second button. Yes, yeah, second uh, step is also ready. And now I want to uh, set up uh, our Firebase. Go to console. Google new. Uh, we created before this uh, Google new project. Uh, before the before the pass authentication, uh, we have to at our uh, say H our say H R uh, number into Firebase fingerprints uh, forget fingerprints uh, number you can uh, click the disk cradle then app task Android and signing reports and yes our uh, fingerprints numbers are here copy and paste here and then uh, we will download this google services go to android studio project uh, we can close these panels go to project uh, and app drag and drop uh, above the app folder refactor and overwrite and uh, and back to android and uh, back to firebase uh, we can uh, open uh, google sign in uh, inside the firebase click google and enable and uh, firebase wants from us uh, a select a, uh, a email 
I selected my email and save. Okay, our Firebase settings are ready. And now we can keep going to uh, create our UI design. But before the UI design, uh, we will add one more dependency. This dependency, uh, you can you can find the project uh, fo folders uh, in the description. I will share a link in the description. Uh, you can click and you can go to my uh, my GitHub account, and you can access uh, all files and all codes uh, using my GitHub repo. Uh, first of all, I want to add some string files inside our string folder and I will paste a string folder like this uh, because I don't want to uh, take uh, from you not too much time as I said before you can uh, find this uh, string folder into my github repo and inside the driver folders, uh, I want to use this uh, my own folders for back background uh, colors. And now one more thing, uh, we have to add some colors for our colors. And now we can keep going to create our UI design. And yes, this is our UI, UI design. Uh, I copied uh, my previous project and pass here. I don't want to uh, spend too much time for create UI design. That's why I copied and passed it. And uh, we will use V binding for our projects. Inside the main activity, uh, we can start to write some codes. Uh, first of all, I want to I want to create our uh, Google signing client clients for the this private slate in its wash Google sign in clients Google signing clients private slate in its wash out Firebase out and private slate in its wash binding activity name binding and now we will connect our binding uh, object to our project, uh, to our uh, main activity. Binding equals to activity main binding that inflates layout inflator binding that root. out equals to firebase dot out and now we can uh, configure configure and now we can configure uh, google sign in configure google Sign in. While GCO equals to Google sign in option. That's builder. Google sign in option default. As Google sign in options default sign in that's request token we can 
take this token into uh, Google Service JSON. Just copy this uh, ID. Pass here. Dot request email. Dot build. Google signing client equals to Google signing. Get client this and GSO. And now finding that Google sign in button that set on click listener. We want to call signing uh, method signing function. While signing. in intents equals to Google signing client that's signing intent starts activity for results signing intent RG sign in and we have to create a campaign <coughs> and now we have to create a campaign object let's create our companion object constants valve rc sign in equals to 1001 and constants valve extra name equals to extra name uh, I created this extra name uh, you will understand later why I created And now we will create uh, our on activity results uh, function and also Firebase out with Google uh, function. You can find this uh, this file into into documentations. Uh, I copy it uh, from documentations and I can pass here. And now uh, we will create our second activity. This uh, second activity, in, uh, we will we will sign in using uh, Google signing methods. Uh, and after uh, our application uh, has to go uh, another activity, that's why we will create this Google signing activity. For this, click new and activity empty activity and okay and we have to uh, write some codes for our google uh, google sign in activity and inside the google signing activity we will define our binding object private late in its bar binding activity google signing binding binding equals to activity google signing that inflate out inflator binding dot root 
binding dot text display name dot text equals to intent dot get string extra extra name you can understand uh, now that's why I created this companion object uh, inside constant while extra name uh, because I want to take uh, name at surname from uh, Google uh, account binding dots uh, inside the activity Google signing uh, we have a logout uh, button Binding that uh, logout that set on click listener five ways out that logout five ways that out that sign out. Well, intent equals to intent application context main activity class shell starts activity intent and uh, if if user clicked this logout button uh, application goes to first page that's why i created this uh, intent and yes uh, it looks uh, we are ready let's 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 test our application Let's click continue with Google. And yes, we can uh, select uh, accounts. And yes, our uh, name and surname also is here. Let's look Firebase. Uh, authentication. And yes, uh, this is our uh, this is our Google accounts resigning uh, this account if you click the this logout button application goes to first page that's it guys thanks for watching uh, i hope this video will help you see you next week